I miss these tournaments. I miss when, like, you know, I see people I care about, like, take interest in this, uh... Hobby. Definitely miss it. It's good to see uh, that Lewis and Doc Lob are still playing and still playing each other here. That's great. We just love melee here, and we love that they turn pause off for the set. We love that. That's some sportsman uh, conduct. That's what a real, a real true friend would do for each other. Only me melee players will understand. Nice forward air pressure by Lewis. That's the that's the pressure we talk about. If someone refuse. Oh, ooh. Someone refuses to um, like DI away when you're comboing them. You have to like take advantage of that. And Falco can do that with forward air. Can definitely do that off shot, off rip too. It doesn't matter. It's just huge pressure. It's hard to deal with. And that should end the set. So Falco putting on some pressure. Keep Sheik like more in shield and threatened. Threatened at close range by like pretty uh, threatening hitboxes. Like that like right there. Like, uh, sort of late down air. Just kinda comboed right into a shine. Like that's the kind of pressure and mix up that 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 will get you like a uh, a sheik to stay in shield after you hit them. If you do an early down air or like a soft down air or a late down air, any of that, all three of those will still lose to like spot dodge down smash. It's like really like stupid stuff. So that's where that that medium like late, like not too late. Downer comes into play. Some people shuffle that. I've seen, like, I think PPMD, like, shuffle that, like, every single time. And I think today, that's what Falco players, like, still try to emulate with their, like, laser game. They try to emulate, like, PPMD, like, down air pressure, like, with perfect execution. Like, that's what they try to emulate with their lasers and literally everything that they do. But that's hard. Lewis doing a good job against Doc Wob. Doc Wob, a, a great player in himself. It's not to be doubted. So it was a nice freak. Did that, um, the dash dance by Dr. Lobster. I don't know why he needled there. That like surprised me. That was a strange time to needle, like the, the Falco like um, It like phantomed, I think. I think that's what happened. I think it phantomed. I think the needle's phantom. That made no sense. The needles phantom, not not the back end. Like what? Did that really just happen? I don't know. I don't know what just, what I just saw. And maybe maybe they clanked in the air with Falco down. I've seen that a million times. Uh, it didn't look like that. That was maybe a phantom. It surprised me. You can't get a phantom clank, so it probably just clanked. That was weird.
Okay. So Lewis took that first game. Doc Lob uh, likes Dreamland a lot against Spacey's. Uh, wow. And he, he read that Lewis was going to plat there at one like what was it, one one eighteen one sixteen. Some ridiculous percent. He just down air forward aired like knew it. Absolutely knew it. Doc Lob shield drops out of attack roll. Gets a nice conversion. And that is Doc Lob at the edge. Doc Lob at the edge is, is like him actually comboing you on plat. I don't know. Men I don't even think he he might not even be looking at you when he's like fucking you up that bad. I don't think he's he's even he's not even looking at the ca the two characters that are that are playing. He's like looking at the ledge, thinking about how he's gonna like like I don't know. Basically, perfectly edge guard you. It doesn't even matter. And that's cheek. Like a good cheek player will will be able to perfectly edge guard you no matter what. Like every single time. And I've, I've played Drefren before, like, people don't talk about Drefren enough, probably, but Drefren will, like, freaking That dude will down throw you over and over again. And he'll he'll do it once. Drefren will down throw you once, let you tech roll away, let you dash dance, like, 300 times, shoot 300 lasers, and then you run in, and then he just goes for down throw again. He just goes for it again. But then, then he'll start fairing. And then all of a sudden, it's just, you're like, well, what am I supposed to do? I got down thrown every single time. I mean, I got it. Drill shine. Why'd I up smash? Why'd I think up smash would have worked? And I'll never forget that set. It wasn't even, I don't, it wasn't even tournament that, that first time. First time I played Dreffen, it was just for fun. But man, he down throwed me so much. <laughs> I didn't really, I didn't really understand, but I kind of get it now. I got, I've played more Sheik, like I kind of get it. I was like, why would he down throw me this much? Like, doesn't does he really feel like it? I mean it's like half the mix-ups of the character, so it's fine, you know. Like I, I get it now. I was like, why would he Anyway, yeah. Nowadays you you know not to disrespect your opponent. You know, just like let them like, you know, shine you over and over again. Like why would you let them do that? That's stupid. Dre Dreffen knows. Dr. Lobster, I think he knows. Lewis, uh, he's doing pretty well this set. I think he knows. I think he knows how to space around Sheik. He knows not to get down thrown. No Falco should be getting down thrown by Sheik. Forget about that. You shoot a laser, like do a down air mix up. You're pretty much safe. Until you, you know, you do a shine and then you get reversal. Because you, you're done or something. I don't know. Falco, hard. Not easy. She's getting a near perfect edge guard sequence set up. So she's like pseudo comboing her way into a back throw. And this is the Dr. Lobster. This is what you dream of the perfect edge guard. I'll smash on Randall. I'll smash on Randall. What happens next? Crap, back row. Nair, you're dead. Welcome to melee. And the perfect edge guard on Lewis's counter pick. It's like a meme, almost. But it's like perfect play, that's what it is. That's what you just saw. Two stocks of getting back thrown. That's what it comes down to. If you're not ready to get to get back thrown by Sheik, you can't, you can't get back thrown twice by Sheik, you're gonna lose the set. Look at this. Which, which Falco wins this? Which Falco wins this? Tell me. Three stocks, three stocks to one, tell me. Against Dr. Lobs, impossible. Dream about it. You can dream. Cause it'll happen like once. Maybe 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 once or twice. 
You're not gonna win it three to one. But Lewis. But Lewis. Oh, okay. Yeah, that was not great. But this is a pretty high level melee. Let's be honest. Dr. Lobster. Lewis. Last stock situation. Oh, Lewis living. So Dr. Lobster very quickly dashed off, short hop, and fast fall back air. Very quickly. If you didn't if you didn't catch how that last game just ended, I, I don't know. He probably down smashed or something right after that. I don't, I don't even remember what just happened. Myself, to be honest. I just I just saw the like the Falco was shielding and then he was on the ground. That sucks. I don't even know what just happened. All I know is that uh, looks like Doc Lob is in the zone. Lewis needs to kind of th throw him off his uh, throw throw his spacing off. Throw him off a little bit. Put on more pressure, but it's tough. It's looking rough. That, that back air right there. So, Dr. Lobster tilt turned. He tilt turned to the right. So, I, I don't know if Falco rolled. I, I don't remember what just happened. But he tilt, like, Falco, like, was shielding, looking at Cheek, rolled in, and then Doc Lob tilt turns, and then he just dashed away short hop back. Like, it's happened so fast. And, and Lewis, I think, like, jumped. Yeah, he jumped. Short high back here. Bam. Tilt turn. Tilt turn. That's what he fuck. That's what he duped Lewis with just now. Tilt turn. I'm pretty sure. I don't know. I'm not. I could be blind. I, I might have missed it. But yeah, that's, that's what just happened. Down throw. Up smash. Hard to beat that sometimes. Because you, 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 when you're playing Falco, like, at least one out of three times, you want to miss tech. One out of three times. Maybe more, maybe like less. Most of the time, lately, I, I don't even... I don't even miss tech. I, I, I do one out of four, because... Sheiks will just, like, up smash. Like, they'll just do the dumbest up smash. And just roll away or something. But no, the up smash wasn't dumb. It covers it. It's it covers fifty. It covers like sixty percent, because you can up smash out of shield. Actually, that, well, is that six, five, three out of six? Yeah. Well, no, three out of five. Yeah, sixty percent covers sixty percent of the options. To 